of this morning he and Bryson DeChambeau will be battling against Tom Brady and Phil Mickelson July 6th somewhere in Montana Big Sky Country Bleacher Report and Capital One have another match for Tom and Phil I'm pumped yeah. I'm pumped about this. We are going to attempt to try to get in the area of Montana, mostly because I've heard nothing but amazing things about Montana. And in the middle of July, there's not much to talk about. So if this is going on, guess what? This might as well be the fucking Super Bowl for this show. Yes, Cannot yeah. wait to chat about that then. Watch what's going on. By then, I would assume a lot of things have unfolded with Aaron and the Packers. How will that go? We will keep an eye out for you that june 1 date by the way everybody thinks is very important not just for aaron but also for julio and some other moves that'll be massive for us but in july ha america's birthday happens and then it's kind of a waiting game yeah mm -hmm. let's hope otani uh throws perfect games every night and hits home runs every single night he might he just hit another one last night by the way uh greatest baseball player of all time Shot. but that's gonna be awesome i'm excited they got that done uh excited to see if tom plays a little bit better this time yeah remember last year he was going into a new team didn't have that much time to golf especially with the COVID era and he had one incredible moment from the golf course when he chipped in from like 200 out didn't showcase his best golf i think he's excited to get back out there with phil phil by the way coming off the biggest weekend of his life where he outdrove a person 20 years younger than him by 16 yards or something like that or 50 yards uh 16th hole going in to win the pga championship at, at the age of 50. i mean yeah. phil yes. mickelson's living his best life aaron's living his best life d shambeau and brooks are having amazing tom this is four guys having the time of their lives going out on the golf course and battling cannot wait to watch it i assume you've already uh touched on the what the a rod and, and bryson phil and tom brady match coming up we let off the show with that but what are your thoughts i'm pumped up july 6th in montana the match is back phil mickelson the lucky lefty the the oldest human to ever win a major in the PGA's 7,000 year career. Champion takes on Bryson DeChambeau and Aaron Rodgers. Aaron has not been golfing. He's been jumping off waterfalls. He's mm -hmm. been singing, singing Taylor Swift. What is, is he ready for this? DeChambeau is not going to play any games out there. I'm excited to watch this. Can't wait for it. And hopefully we'll be able to be at the big time in Big Sky. Oh, you want to go there? You're going to go to it? Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to see who I got to call. I would. I think we should do a live show from that for sure. You know. So this is uh, who's care? Is it? Oh, TNT. So is like Charles going to be following them in the fairway and all that? I would assume they're going to do something similar like that. Yeah, but Bleacher Report and TNT have a relationship with Fanduel. Uh huh. So I think we potentially have a. You know. Well, I think, we have a potential, way I think we have a potential way in. Don't want to ruin the show. Don't want to be on the show. Don't need to be on the show. Don't have me on the show. But I think us live from there would be hilarious. Like, I, I think that would be very funny for our show. Now, that's not going to be allowed, I'd assume, because Capital One paid a lot of money and it's not going to be able to. But I have sent out some uh, lawn darts, seeing if I can stab the right uh, situation. You yes, know what I mean? so you Tom's could remind shit. Capital One, too. Hey, we had the second biggest bracket in you guys' March Madness thing. You know, so I mean, we are. We, we have worked we, together. We do yeah. have. We've worked together. We have a previous relationship here. And I have a Capital One card. Boom. Okay. Here we go. So, I mean, what are we doing here? Now, the way you guys handled me because of my age and everything like that with how much I was allowed to spend there for like a year was a little bit of a problem. I thought you were judging me a little bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, but since then, we've had great conversations. It's great to be a Capital One family member in there. And thank you for the rewards. Okay. Mm. Thank you so much for the rewards. I don't know where to get them, but I get a text message telling me that they do come. So I'm very thankful for that. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. Tom Brady's talking a lot of shit, though. I like it. He's cooking right now. Tom, by the way, also not at OTAs, voluntary OTAs. He has come out in big support of the players, you know, kind of standing their ground with this OTA thing. Like, let's, this is better for everybody long term. He's training. I assume they're back at the school they were at. He has a sick shirt. I mean, his oh, yeah. new merch has all of his Super Bowls that he's won down the spine. It is a great piece of merch. He's been training. I can't wait to see how this thing pans out. Well, I think uh, it'll be cool now that now that Tom jumps out there and is not scared to promote this thing. I think Bryson is going to dip his toes in the water too. Like I don't know how active Bryson is on Twitter. You guys will know better. It, like you think Bryson and Arod, this is going to become a thing because we know Phil's getting in the game for sure. I think a lot of people are potentially upset that it's not Arod Brooks. Yeah, Brooks's health probably had it, something to do with that. 
And I assume the PGA was like, hey, we got this golf ball whacker guy. Mm -hmm. The needle for him moved more than anybody else. So Bleacher Report, TNT is like, oh, this is the guy we want to get in here. But with where the world currently stands for DeChambeau, is he just going to go ahead? I mean, is he going to talk? I think he is. I think he's got to buy in at this point now. And Aaron's his teammate. So does Aaron have to do a little bit of that as well? It seems like it. Yeah, probably. I mean, also, just how far DeChambeau can hit it, like, it'll be worth it on the, you know? I mean, I think he adds enough value. And I think they said Rodgers is like a, what, like a three or a four, maybe. So, like, he's also a very, very good golfer. I'm, I'm excited to watch this. Hey, he's a good player, huh, AJ? Yeah, he is a good player. I don't know if he was a three or a four right now. I don't think he's been playing as much lately as he has in the past. So we will see. I'm sure he would not have agreed to it if he didn't feel pretty good about his game. though. Yeah. And when do you think it all came about? Just here recently, you think? I mean, I would think this had to happen. Like they had to have Phil talking with him before he won. The PGA, correct? Like, I, I, this I, didn't just pop out of nowhere, I don't think. Maybe they're like, they had preliminary conversations. Would you want to do this again if we could? Would you want to do this again if you could? Then when Tom says, let's go teammate after he wins and they do it, maybe that's when they're like, hey, now's the time. Let's go ahead and do it. I, I I don't think it was planned before this win, but I think maybe the, the and who knows, and this is very dumb for me to say because I fucking have no idea, but it feels like unless they were working, unless Tom was working, immediately after that PGA championship, like, hey, let's remember now, we are teammates, Phil responds, it's like, we got a match. If they're doing like boxing, WWE promotion, like more power to them, that is awesome. And by the way, Tom Brady, who does social media very well, would do something like that. Whatever the case, I'm excited for it, I'm pumped for it. And how many times is Aaron gonna get asked there, you know, what his plans are if it's not figured out by then? Let's assume that that is now the deadline for everything to get figured out with the Packers. Let's assume that's that's what it's gonna be. Is Miles well, Teller I'm, gonna be his caddy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are they gonna take caddies or do you think they'll take the carts like Tom and, and Peyton did? Well, the carts were because of COVID, right? I am auctioning them off for big, charity. They were a big hit, though. Yeah, I love the yeah, card. Right. And yeah, also the GoPro. Yeah, and they had the camera inside there. Got to do the card. Have to have the cards yeah. again. Got to do the card. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, it's going to be fun. I think Aaron and Bryson will be a fun dynamic to see those two interact. I have no idea if they have a relationship at all, if they know each other. I would assume they do somewhat. So I think their personalities could be fun together. You think Aaron knows about the Kepka meme? What do you mean? The anything bad yes. is Bryce yes. and DeChambeau and then Brooks kept mm-hmm. his face. Of course. He does know about that? Of course. Even the Packers kicking a field goal meme? Yeah, from Brady. From Brady? Oh, I haven't seen that. Oh, yeah. yeah. I oh, mean. Yeah. I haven't really. Okay. It's a shot. <laughs> <laughs> That's that one. But Bryson, happy to be here. Aaron realizing he has to spend the whole day with Bryson. Tom Brady tweeted this out. Okay. I like these. Yeah, me too. I'm a big fan of these. And the guy that he just got teammate, uh, tag team partner with, is the guy in the back who's being associated with every bad thing that has ever happened in the world. <laughs> yeah. There uh, you go. Packers kicking a field goal down seven. Aaron Rodgers. I mean, it is. This is Tom well, Brady, by the way. Yeah. This is, yeah. I mean, Aaron, but. Aaron's not mad about that. LaFleur can be mad about that, but Aaron can't be upset about it. LaFleur can't be mad about anything on uh, Sports Center. Aaron said, I love my teammates. I love my coaches. Mm-hmm. Everything else. So he won. Me, Tom Brady making <laughs> memes. Aaron and <laughs> <laughs> People are smart, man. I like this. Dude, Tom is a legend, dude.